This week on The Modified World, I'm going to tell you more stuff about things that I did in Colorado. So stay tuned. Yeah. Uh. So welcome to The Modified World. It's the weekly web show about body modification. The people who do it, the people who get it, and why it matters. I'm your host. I'm the senior piercer up here at the world-renowned Pangea Piercing and purvey internet wackiness. And, okay, so this week, well, I should back up. Last week, you saw me fly into Colorado in the Mile High City of Denver. Get scooped up by my boy P. Daddy Duckett's John Pierre Rogers one Salve. And, and we wound up going to the Denver Natural History Museum, which is a really cool thing. And we ended up by uh, going to exercise our rights by going to purchase marijuana legally. So I literally just went and, and, and bought ganja in a store. It's in this bag. That's pretty cool. It's kind of strange. But I probably ought to find some place to go and partake of it. Saying this is pretty rad, but it's totally legal, and I mean, not even just totally legal, it's actually legal. This is craziness. Jeez, look at all this. It, dude, you can find it in the dirt. See? Holy oh, shit. that's a gold nugget. Colorado is so full of natural beauty the mountains and rivers, and all manner of forests and there's wildlife and minerals galore. I love that type of stuff. You know I love that. But then also too, there's something to be said for having the freedom of choice to be able to, well, you know, if you want to have a, you know, have some of the delicious beer, wine, or spirits, well, you can do that. But if you are more like uh, inclined to, you know, smoke fine cannabis, well, you can do that too. Without fear, without fear of reprisal and taking the criminal element out of it. Not only that, but literally bill, you know, well, literally millions of dollars have been poured into the state coffers because instead of all of it being part of the underground economy, it's part of the above ground economy and people are paying taxes and fees on it and stuff, which is kind of a, I guess, kind of a good thing. They say the crime has dropped significantly and just all the way around has been somewhat of a you know a fairly positive thing. Now not everybody agrees, of course. There's some people that kind of decry the fact that there's so much, there's so many, you know, marijuana stores around everywhere. But I feel like for the most part, you know, at least what I've seen, it's been a you know an interesting experience. I don't know if it would work as well everywhere. But, you know, given it enough time, I'm pretty sure that most folks are going to kind of start to tend to agree because the other thing is, is it created, you know, literally thousands of jobs for people in Colorado, you know, legally growing marijuana, distributing it and testing it and all that stuff. So, hey, fair enough. And it's nice to just be able to come up here in the mountains next to a beautiful river with your good homies and be able to, I don't know, commune with nature, the great and the grandest cathedral of all.
like what I'm talking about right here. This is like what I'm talking about right here, this type of Oh yeah, look at this. Oh my god. This is exact, oh man. Oh, this is too cool. Now you, now you know where I live here. I know, this is amazing, man. Legal weed, Penny Arcade. Oh yeah, hell yeah, we're gonna play. That could possibly be the most disturbing thing I've seen. Actually, the oldest arcade in America, from what I've been told, since like 1924. It's amazing. If you're ever out in that area, please go by the old school arcade. I'm drinking lithium and infused, naturally carbonated water coming right out of natural springs. I love Manitou Springs. It is really nice. But anyway, that was my show this week. I hope you hope you're entertained, learn something, maybe, I don't know. We do this all the time, every week. So throw me a subscription. And I know you guys hassle me all the time about where do I go find jewelry? Dude, I've got the solution now. You can go over to my website, PangeaPiercing.com. We have thousands of products uploaded now all ready for your, I don't know, viewing pleasure. So seriously, go by and check it out. You know, I'd appreciate it if you did. And be sure to stop back by next week for another episode of The Modified World.